Hi, Cal from BHP UK. And on the dyno today, we've got this Triumph uh, Street Triple. It's the 765 RS model. It's a 2018 model and it's Euro 4 compliant. Uh, the customer has fitted a Scorpion end can on this bike, so we're going to get it run up on the dyno, see what the fueling's doing, and take a read from the ECU before we start to map it. Right, so that's a stock bike run on the dyno and we found that it, the back wheel at wide open throttle, the bike's making 115 brake horsepower. Now the fueling at the top end as standard is not a million miles out, so there's not gonna be a lot of changes that need to be made there. However, anything below 80%, as you can see on here, is very lean. Uh, the red plot, it's a little bit complicated to look at this, it's a little bit, uh, it's a little bit jumbled up, but at uh, the, the red line uh, signifies what the air fuel ratio is doing at 25%, the blue re line represents 50% and the green line represents 70 with the brown line representing 100% as we said before the, the, the fueling at the top end at wide open throttle isn't so bad. Uh, we're going to get into the ECU, this, this bike's running a key in ECU, uh, we've already taken a read of that, we're going to put some maps on it and try it again on the dyno uh, and see if we can fix that fueling. That fueling is really what's going to improve the throttle response and the power delivery of this bike at partial throttle openings. Right, we've got this bike set up now pretty much how we wanted to. Uh, at, the, at the top end, a wide open throttle, we've managed to, to get the power up from 115 brake horsepower to 119. We've also been able to fill the, the little dip in between 6 uh, and 8,000 RPM. Uh, that wasn't really the biggest gains on the bike. We feel that the throttle response is far better now. Uh, any openings up to 80%, we've had to add quite a bit of fuel in. Uh, as we said before, the, the bike was very lean as standard, so we've had to put quite a bit of fuel in to correct that. We to put a little bit of advance in uh, to give you a little bit more power at the at wide open throttle. Now there are other things we can do with this bike. We can uh, uh, things like you can we can run decat systems on it, and we can also um, uh, lower the temperatures that the uh, cooling fans operate at. That's a, a good bonus if you're riding the bike around traffic. Uh, it keeps everything a little bit cooler. This bike now is fully developed and it is available on our ECU flasher. Uh, if you're not local to us, we can send you one of these programming devices uh, and you can program your own bike. It would still be one of our map writers writing you a custom map for your bike. Please do like the video and subscribe to the channel. It really does help us out. And if you do have any comments, please drop them in the comment section below. We're always happy to talk to uh, fellow bikers and fellow petrol heads. Uh, let us know if there's anything that you, you think we could do next or if there's any projects that you're interested in, just drop them in the comment section below and we'll see what we can do for you.